Hi friends, this is your prophet, Prophet Great. Please, today is the very first time of watching our channel. We entreat you that you subscribe, you like, and you share. And also drop your comments. Praise God. Today, we're dealing with prayer points against evil altars. Now, there's something you must understand. That evil altars are deadly. Evil altars are destructive. Until they are destroyed, your life can never move forward. Remember your ancestors, your great, 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 great grandfather served idols, worship idols. Praise God. And so your foundation is what is fighting you. Your foundation is fighting war against your life. Psalm 11 verse number 3. If the foundation be faulty, what can the righteous do? And that's what God told Gideon when Gideon was lamenting that nothing is working in his life. God said to him, is the foundation, the altars in your father's house. Go and destroy it. Judges chapter 6 verse 25. As soon as Gideon destroyed the evil altars, he emerged as the president of Israel for 42 years. Praise God. You're going to pray this prayer loud and clear. Say, you evil altar. You evil altar in my father's house. Fighting my life. Fighting my going forward. Cut fire in the name of Jesus. You evil altar in my father's house. Ah, fighting my success. Fighting my progress. Fighting my wedding. Fighting my marriage. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Pray that prayer. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus. Mighty name we pray. Pray this prayer loud and clear. Say you angels of the living God. Angels of war. I send you to my father's house right now. I send you in that water. I send you in that sea. I send you in that evil place where there are erected altars against me that is fighting me in the name of Jesus. Angels, go destroy the altars. Go destroy the altars. Go scatter the altars in the name of Jesus. Go! Open your mouth and pray. Send the angels. Send the angels to go destroy, to go scatter. To go crush, to go scatter every altar erected against you in Jesus' name. The first thing Balak did when he was brought by Balak to cause the children of Israel was to erect altar and offer sacrifice. Say in the name of Jesus, you evil altar that has received sacrifice to fight me, to frustrate me, blood of Jesus destroy you. Blood of Jesus destroy you. Open your mouth and pray that prayer as a prayer warrior that you are in the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer. Destroy, scatter, destroy, scatter, destroy, scatter in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Destroy that evil altar. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Matthew chapter 15, verse 13. The Bible speaks, it says, Whatever my heavenly Father have not planted shall be uprooted. That altar is not established by God. It's established by evil men in order to harm the family, harm your life. You want to pray in the name of Jesus? You evil altar, by the authority in the name of Jesus, I uproot you and I set you on fire. I uproot you and I set you on fire in the name of Jesus. If Jesus said you can uproot, you can uproot. So go ahead, uproot every evil altar in the spirit by the power. In the name of Jesus, that other of mental delay, that other of frustration, that other of pain, that other of sorrow, that other of near success syndrome, uproot it, destroy it in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, pray this prayer loud and clear. Say, You evil altar of rejection, you evil altar of setback, you evil altar of sorrow, you evil altar of poverty, you evil altar. Of nothingness working against me, working against my life. Your time is up. I set to on fire. 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 Open your mouth. Pray and crush that altar. Open your mouth and destroy that altar. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Destroy that evil altar by fire, by thunder. In Jesus' name. We are praying this by loud and clear. The Bible speaking, it says in the book of Luke chapter 10, verse 19, Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions, and over all the powers of the enemy, 
and nothing shall by any hurt you. Right now, in the name of Jesus, every evil altar anywhere erected against me, speaking against me, fighting against me, I cross you. I cross you by fire. I cross you in the name of Jesus. I cross you by the authority in the name of Jesus. By the Holy Ghost power within me, I cross you. Satanic altars, marine altars, occultic altars, witchcraft altars, ancestral altars, I cross you. Nah! In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. God is answering your prayers. Your prayers causing havoc in the kingdom of darkness. In the name of Jesus. Pray, pray, pray. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Lastly, we're going to pray in the name of Jesus. Oh God, my Father, disconnect me from every evil altar. Disconnect me from every evil altar in the name of Jesus. Any altar that my life, my children are connected to. Holy Ghost, disconnect me. Disconnect me from such evil altars. From such evil altars in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray that the Lord will disconnect you from such evil satanic altars in Jesus' name. I pray for you. That evil altar in your father's house is destroyed by fire, by thunder, in Jesus' name. Shalom. God bless you.